Hello, family and friends. Welcome back. Welcome back to my channel, Almas Decor and Party Ideas. Um, today, I am going to share with you a haul of things that I purchased in different stores um, to style my next event, which is going to be a Sunday brunch. I was thinking like how fast this summer has just, it just disappeared. And, uh, you know, the coronavirus make, made it extra difficult for us to, I mean, for everybody to gather or get together. Um, but now at least I think the regulations is like you can have five people um, at your house or a gatherings of five people. Um, so if it's possible, I would like to have my ladies, uh, friends over. And I decided that uh, because I last year I purchased few items that, um, well, actually a lot of items and I couldn't use them at all because last year I couldn't entertain um, pretty much not, nothing. Um, and I do, I, they spent a year in, in storage, so I, I'm eager to use them. I cannot believe that this is gonna be a second summer and I will not be able to use them. That's not fair. <laughs> but I'm just gonna share with you what I got. Um, I went to uh, various places and purchased here and there. And I wanna share with you what I got for this a special brunch and the theme is going to be summer lemons and it's going to be beautiful uh, the palette that i decided was uh, bright yellow white um, buffalo checker print and um, also if it's possible and if i can incorporate a little bit of blue i will if it doesn't look fine i'll just take it out Okay, we're gonna start with something that everybody in the decor and craft community are going crazy about it. And is the 2021 <laughs> calendar. I know, I know those that of you that um, are from other channels, you know, this is the hot, hot cakes right now these are hot cakes right now and uh, actually i i heard and i saw because i when i heard it i couldn't believe it so i went to ebay and uh because i heard that they were right now they're selling it for 15 dollars each of these that's crazy and it's true because i went i went they went from 15 dollars all the way to 20 dollars so I did something when I saw that I went back and I have extra. So if you comment down below and you let me know that you want the fresh market cart uh, calendar, um, I will do a raffle. Everything is gonna be on video. And um, if your name is selected, I'm gonna send it to you. What about that? And this farmer's market has beautiful, look at these. Such a beau, they have beautiful prints. And this is why the community, the craft community, <coughs> and the, the, I'm sorry, the decor community are going crazy with it because these are endless possibilities for us to um do crafts or decor look at how pretty is the the november one with the with the vintage red truck which everybody's crazy about i love it so i got few of these um 2021 farmer's market calendar and i also got this one which is simply blessed and this one is more, um, more like a farmer, a farmhouse decor, uh, which is I'm not fan of it. Um, I I do have other style or other decor style, and I do admire 
all of you that have beautiful homes with all that farm um, decor, but it's not my taste for to be quite honest. But this calendar, I got it because it has these, let me see, I put it right here. It has, not only has beautiful prints as well, as you can see, but look at this one for autumn. How beautiful is that? I just really, really admiring. Ah, look, this is why I got it. Because it has this print with lemons too. And I think I'm gonna use that for style, to style my, my gathering, my brunch event. So I have this one and guess what? Because I love you guys, I also have an extra of that one. So you let me know which one will you prefer, which raffle do you want, the Simply Blessed or the Farmer's Market Calendar Raffle. And we're gonna do a video. When you comment down below, I'm gonna do a video. I also got this one. And this one has beautiful prints as well, if you can see. And actually, uh, the craft that I'm going to do for the gathering that I, the, for the brunch um, is with the farmer's market um, print. So just to give you hints. And I mean, you can, you can frame those, you can do like decorative plates, you can decoupage them with pretty much everything. It's just a lot of things. I mean, I'm not a crafter, but I'm creative, <laughs> so I can understand why, why everybody's crazy about those. Okay, the second item that I want to share with you is the Buffalo Check Ribbon. And I wanted to highlight that these particular rolls are three yards, three yards and nine feet, which is enough for a bow. And uh, I, I mean, I love black and white, regardless if it's trendy or not. Um, I, I just love the pattern. I love the, the decoration of the buffalo shed. And that's kind of farmy, but hey, I'm not saying I hated it. It's just that, you know, like it's not completely my taste. Okay, so keeping on. Oh, and I wanted to highlight also this is open. That is, it is a wired, it is a wired ribbon and that helps a lot to do your bows. But what I wanted to highlight is that the fa the actual fabric of the ribbon, it is soft. It is soft and sometimes when you buy, I mean, those these are not really the best quality ribbons. Sometimes the, the fabric is so hard to work with, but this one is not. So go ahead and stock up on the Buffalo Shack. I also got these gorgeous, bright yellow roses and the reason why i got them is of course because they're bright yellow and that's the color scheme for the gathering but um also because these particular roses are not bloom and for me they even resemble like a lemon so how cool is that i got two yellows and i got one white and I'm still debating how I'm gonna, if I'm gonna do a, just a bouquet, or if I'm going to do a topiary that I have in my garage, um, maybe with these ones. And I also got these because uh, if I, at the end, um, these are dripping, <clears throat> dripping monsoons. Um, if at the end I decide to do a bouquet, I always like to add some something to add dimension to it or to add some interest to it. So these, a flower arrangement for $5, you cannot beat that, that's very, very good. I also wanna share with you that I found all these items are from Dollar Tree, all these items. I also found this Baker um, <clears throat> twine and look how pretty that is bright yellow and 
white and um just for a dollar and i think if i'm not mistaken well it does it's not so specified but it is a lot going on there so you can do a lot of projects with it and i just want to let you know that for this one it is this one is a little thicker and of course have the fancy wood roll but for this one i almost pay i think it was almost four dollars in hobby lobby and that's you know and this one is just a dollar so but i have both of them and they're probably gonna i'm gonna utilize them in some projects i also got and i'm sorry this is open but i couldn't i couldn't help myself i got a lemon drops bag um to use it in my styling too. And I got this plastic plate, and this is going to be utilized for the craft that we're gonna, I'm gonna probably gonna shoot that um, tomorrow. And uh, we're, I'm gonna make a decorative, decorative plate with, uh, with this print, whoopsie, with this print, from the fresh market calendar. And I hopefully, I'm gonna give you just a heads up of probably how this is gonna look for my brunch, for my lemon brunch. And I want you just to let you know, hey, not every single decor needs to be expensive because if you're like me, that we, I love to change, I love to, um, decorate every single for every single event for every single holiday hey it's not a crime to go to the Dollar Tree or to Dollar General to a family dollar and just check it out first what they have there what you can buy over there and and help your budget stretch and stuff that you cannot find or very specific items that you probably want then you go to the more fancy stores like maybe hobby lobby or michael's i don't have a michael's here that's too bad but i do have a hobby lobby and that's how i do i purchase some at hobby lobby and some at the dollar stores so this craft i'm gonna uh, share with you in a separate video um how to make that decorative plate Okay, keep going on here. I went to Burke's and I found these spreaders. Look how pretty they are. Because for my brunch, I was thinking maybe to have some spreads and bagels. And I, when I saw this, I said, well, this is perfect. And they have little palm trees. I mean, it's not, it's not lemons. It's okay. It's okay. You can mix and match. <laughs> And but it also when I saw the palm trees, I said, "Oh, it reminds me of Puerto Rico, my birthplace, beautiful island." So these four, they were original original price for five ninety nine, and this one was for three fifty nine. That's a deal. That's a good deal. So remember that I told you about the items that I purchased last summer and I didn't use. Let me show you what it is. I purchased this beautiful um, salad plate, a dinner plate, the coffee mugs, and the placemats. All of this was purchased at the Dollar Tree, believe it or not. Look at the print, how beautiful with the lemons and the green is not a bright green which i really like and it have these beautiful like white flowers i really really like this print it looks high end and is it did not cost i mean it has the high end look without the high cost look how pretty and every, you know what i i google it is all because of the green because they um choose a moss green instead of a bright green and i'm going to show you the dinner plate 
okay? How pretty that is. And I want you to know that when you have a lot of, like it, like this one, this has a lot of print, a lot of lemons. What I decided is that I am not gonna use the dinner plates. The dinner plates are going to be utilized as, you know, to serve like the appetizers or serve the, the food. And then I will, I'm gonna use my placemat with a plain white um, di dinner dish and then this one on top. Just to, you know, because you need to blend when you have so many, too much print, if you don't blend it, it, it can look off. So just play with your dishes and just, if, it, if it's too much, you can subtract. And uh, if it needs more, you add. That's as easy as that. But for me, sometimes I like it, um, I like it uh, sometimes simple. For certain things, I really go out. But for my tablescapes, I really try to achieve a look that looks elegant with less, if that makes sense. Okay, so I have this beautiful, so I'm very, I'm eager, eager to use these lemon print plates and placemats as soon as possible. Okay, so what else I have left? I have two or more items left to show you and then we're gonna grab up with this uh, video. Um, when my, it was not, it was with visit before, uh, I think it was two weeks ago that I got this book at Dollar Tree and I personally do, I do not, I mean, I used to, I used to um, it celebrate Halloween, but since my son is older, I, I don't. But when I saw this book, I thought about some friends that Mr. Ray Martinez, Angelica Martinez, that they love Halloween and they go out every single Halloween and we are invited, thank God, every time. So we go to their parties. So I got this book for him and for her in order for them to get ideas. And the beauty of this book is that covers from, it has everything. It has landscapes, it has um, vintage. Look at this, how pretty. It has vintage ideas, it has spooky ideas, and it has some, uh, stuff that is not that spooky. And the whole look of the, look, the whole look of this book is very high-end. Like everything looks high-end. And I'm not sure if you can see over here, I don't know if you can see it, but the price, the original price was $19.95. And I mean, it feels and it looks like a $19 book and or a $19 uh, high-end magazine just for a dollar. So Jelly Sandre, this is for you. All right. And last but not least, look what I found. Beautiful scarecrow. And last year I, uh, decided to decorate uh, fall with traditional colors incorporating the blue and I was so happy to find him and he's all ready to celebrate look at him he has a beautiful smile and the welcome and I mean he's ready to roll and ready to celebrate fall I'm I'm ready too are you <laughs> I hope you are because we are going to have a lot of fun this fall and I hope you stay tuned with us and um, keep uh, keep watching our videos and our fall ideas. Well, thank you so much for, for and I hope you enjoy it. And uh, every everything, every item that I show you today will be utilized in my next event, which I'm looking forward not only to happen, but to style it. I'm just eager to do it. Well, say, see you then. I'll send you love as always. Love, love, love and peace. God bless. Bye-bye.